Welcome back. With us right now is James Tung of Third Mutual. Good to see you, James. Thank you. Glad to be back. Uh, great to have you here today. You got a few things you want to talk about today, and one of the first ones is about the solar power project update. Yes, uh, we're excited. <clears throat> you know, we uh, in Third Mutual we spent more than two million dollars. Uh, uh, effort by our uh, energy chair mm -hmm. Bill Wash and mm -hmm. staff Mark Stahl and uh, 12, uh, supposed to have 12 Garden Villa buildings, surge storage building, will install the, the uh, uh, solar power. In fact, the installation is done, but uh, uh, it takes time for Ad <laughs> Edison to give us a permission. Right. To, uh, <clears throat> to produce electricity. So now, the last week, the, fine, the seventh and eighth uh, building were giving the permission. So now total is uh, eight out of the 12 uh, buildings on a, the solar panel on the top of the okay. building start produce the electricity and send to uh, Edison. So we will, from now on, we'll save more money, you know, along the Garden Villa building, uh, like uh, uh, Bray of Brassways, the hallways, all that. Yeah. Right, and so the other four will be done soon. Yeah. They're they're installed, but the permission yeah, to operate. It, yeah, uh, Edison takes <clears throat> time for right. Edison to one at a time give us the permission. Okay. Right? Yeah. But those should be coming online, online pretty soon, right? Pretty soon, yes. Very good. Yeah. Now, uh, as far as uh, landscape goes, you want to address a concern from the Orange County Fire Authority, right? Yes, uh, because uh, you remember uh, maybe a year or, or a year and a half ago, there was a little bit of fire uh, along the, uh, <coughs> uh, you know, out, uh, I think it's uh, Laguna Beach mm -hmm. area. Mm -hmm. So. Uh, the the Orange County Fire Authority are very much concerned on the, on the western edge of our community. Right. And uh, we our landscape is fully aware of that. In fact, we just we started last month, and then the work will be completed in May uh, on the, along the uh, Gate 10 and um, Gate 11, Gate 10 area. Okay. Yeah, that will be done in May sometime. Okay. Before We're, the you know, weather getting really yeah, hot exactly. and dry. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Also around Gate 14. Yeah, there was, a, <clears throat> you know, the people concerned about coyotes, aesthetic mm -hmm. problems, mm -hmm. and that has been just completed. Okay. Uh, so, so yeah, we, we're in good shape. Yeah, as far as, and on the turf replacement, uh, you know, we keep telling people in the long run, California is, uh, you know, most likely we'll have more drought. Right. So we want to replace the regular turf with uh, either the gravels or uh, ground covers, which is save water and labors. And then more and more people responded. So, so far, um, 100, uh, 182 you know, uh, men or so, uh, families already says, yeah, we love it. So, and among those 182, 27 have been completed. Yeah, and exactly. 29 are in progress. Uh, the other 126 are in the planning stage. By that, we meant some of them, <clears throat> you know, they, they all, the, including the rest, of course, the rest of themselves, owner right. themselves, is agree. But then they got to uh, got to ask the neighbors to say, "Hey, do you agree we change that?" And that's what we call the planning. You okay. Know, some of them have to go through the neighbor, <coughs> make sure the neighbor have no objections. Okay. So you're yeah. checking within each area if everyone likes that or not. Yeah. Oh, of okay. course. Yeah, of course. We we never do anything without you know let, letting people know or get their permission. Right. Yeah. yeah. And of course, once this is done, or more and more of it is done, it's going to certainly cut down on the watering. Of course. And the maintenance as well, right? Yes, labors. <clears throat> yeah. 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 And uh, then the, the last thing I want to talk about is, uh, of course, uh, I, we are still always watching the water. Right. And, uh, and so far, uh, some of the buildings, uh, well, l last month, uh, the, the staff, the plumbing department, work on one building, uh, which is, of course, is Garden Villa, and they have, they found, oh no, this is not Garden Villa, eight, eight units, and uh, they found one has was a leaking toilet, mm -hmm. the other one is, uh, 
is the master bathroom mm. is uh, leaking all the time. I mean, really? run water all the times. So this, well, they mm. already notified the resident and hopefully, and of course, I have to go knocking the door, checking right. with those residents, <clears throat> make sure they actually do it and save more water. Right, yeah. so the, uh, the master bath, the, that person's master bath, what was going on, a leaky faucet or? Um, probably, okay. yeah, because it's <clears throat> water, you know, the staff report the water's been running all the times. Yeah. So you, can, you can imagine, no matter how small yeah. the, the leaks, it's a lot of water gone by. That's why it was for several months, that building was on wow. top, you know, their water meter was at top of the list of yeah. uh, a high tier water bills. Yeah, yeah. exactly. Yeah. And I know that's something that uh, yeah. you know, you've really been working on. And yeah, we, uh, we've been, you know, the, the <coughs> other staff and, you know, Jews, and, you know, we've been visiting all the meters. In fact, very interesting, um, one of the water meter, uh, we couldn't find it at first because normally the water meter is in the grass area with mm -hmm. a concrete cover. <clears throat> right. But in this particular case, it was on the concrete, so they changed it to a metal, metal cover. So we we looking, looking around, finally uh, talking to the to the resident. Right. He said, uh, do you know where this water meter is? Of course, they don't. They don't yeah. check it there. So, but they, they those two ladies were so nice. They, they, they uh, go around the building and uh, find, try to find anything suspicious. But then finally they say, what about this one? <coughs> we say, okay, well, let me, let's, let's check. Whew, there he is, water meter. Oh, so very good. But we, we were so glad to find it. Yeah. <laughs> well, great. And uh, of course. But the last thing, very important. Yeah, I was going to talk about the high tier. Yeah, yeah, well, see, this one, we've been there <coughs> in fair consistently, and it turned out there's the, no leaking. Okay. So that means in that building, some people may have a bad habit, you know, either watering their uh, plants too much mm -hmm. or using something else. So we have to working with a building captain, hopefully okay. to uh, to you know improve that situation. Okay, so you need to pinpoint it down. Right. Right. All right. Very good. Yeah. And of course, you'll be at the meeting tomorrow. Tomorrow. And as I said earlier to people. Please keep in mind, it's still over at City Hall. Right. So it'll yeah. probably be for what, another, probably in April as well, I think. Yeah, I don't know how soon they're going to complete that okay. remodeling. All right. right, so that'll yeah. be tomorrow at 9.30. If you want to head on over there, just again, remember, it's at City Hall, right? Yeah, tomorrow I will cover a little bit more details Okay. On all those items. All right, James, good to see you. Thank you very much. Take yeah, care. Glad to be here. We'll see you again, and yeah. we'll be right back. Thank you. <coughs>